Hello everyone. Welcome back. Today we are going to learn about measurements. Think of the olden days. There were no printed money or measuring tools. Some say that people used barter system for trade where they are able to exchange things as we say give and take. Also, people used their body parts to measure. These measurements have different names. Let us learn about them one by one. The length of the tip of the middle finger to the elbow is called cubit. You can see one cubit measure in the screen. The length of the thumb to the little finger is called span. We can also say the hand span. The measure of the longest toe to the heel is called foot span. The length of one step while walking is called pace. Can you say whether all these Measurements are accurate? No. Why? Because man is different. Their hands and legs are different. So, these are not accurate measurements. These are non-standard units of measurements. As the measurements differ from person to person. For uniformity, we need Standard Tools and Units Gabriel Motem from France is considered to be the founding father of the metric system. The instruments what we use to measure things are found after his discovery. These are some of the units used to measure. First, let us see how to measure the length. And what is length? Length is the measure of the object from one end to the other end. You can see some things placed on the scale to measure its length. The standard unit of length is meter. The other units are centimeter, millimeter and kilometer. Smaller lengths are measured using millimeters and centimeters. Here you can see a centimeter scale is used to measure the smaller objects. Longer lengths are measured using meters. The height of the tree, the length of the swimming pool, the length of the dress materials, etc. are measured using meters. The geographical length is called distance. The distance is measured in kilometers. That is the distance from your house to park, etc. are measured in kilometers. These are some standard units of conversion of length. 1 centimeter is equal to 10 millimeter. 1 meter is equal to 100 centimeter. 1 kilometer equal to 1000 meter. Next is weight. Weight is the measure of the heaviness of an object. It means we are measuring how heavy the object is. The metric measures that are used to weigh objects are kilogram and gram. Lighter objects are measured in grams. Heavier objects are measured in kilograms. Weight is measured using a weighing mission, physical balance, etc. The standard unit of measuring weight is kilogram. 1 kilogram is equal to 1000 grams. Now coming to capacity. Capacity is the measure of the amount of liquid a container can hold. The standard unit of measuring capacity is 
liter. Smaller quantities are measured in milliliters and larger quantities are measured in liters. 1 liter is equal to 1000 milliliter. We can say a bucket can hold 3 or 4 liters of water and a mug will hold 500 milliliters of water. You can see the difference of the teacup and a kettle. A teacup hold little and a kettle can hold more. In this video, we learned non-standard units and standard units of measurements. Thank you for watching.